Well, at GSR, you have regulators from about 130 countries come, and it's very difficult to get all those people together at one time, but it happens once or twice a year, and ITU organizes that. So it's a really a brilliant forum for an industry company like Intel to be part of that, because many of the programs we need to do in countries get driven by the regulators. You look at national broadband plans. There's typically IT equipment in those. They benefit economies, they benefit education, they benefit health, and the regulators drive the national broadband plans or are part of it. Um, they're part of the Universal Service Fund, which often puts broadband and equipment in rural areas that otherwise would not normally get it. And so major impacts of being at this conference. I think the future's moving quicker than any of us would have anticipated. It's very much like the cell phone and how they went from two billion to six or seven billion. And it's happening in broadband as well, but it needs constant um, investment. It needs constant people putting programs together and it needs diligence to make sure they're reaching the right people. And I think it's moving quickly. Technology is moving at an incredible pace. And it's really, can you get it to the people that needs to be got to, to benefit from the technology? And this is what the regulators help us do. And my whole opening panel was to encourage national broadband plans to reach, um, affordability, so prepaid broadband, one of my favorite subjects, so that people can afford it, and then getting it to the rural and the otherwise um, less privileged people that don't have access to technology. And so it allowed us to talk about all those subjects. I think the key areas are reaching the people that just don't benefit or have access to the internet. There's two billion that do, means there's five billion that don't. And so how do I reach them in the areas that they live? How do I make it affordable to them? How do I give them the benefits that would give them the reason to want the technology and use it? So how do I benefit their businesses, their education, their healthcare, their social interactions? And really reaching that next several billion has been the big focus. And I don't think it's a um, technology impossibility. It's just doing it and focusing it with real programs across countries to make a difference. And that takes time, that takes effort, that takes cooperation, it takes leadership. All of those happen here.